so, okay, so did you grow up in Toronto? Calgary. Yeah. Calgary? Yeah. Oh, yeah, on the west. The great, uh... The great western part of Canada. Cowboys, oil barons. Guy Branham would know. Yeah, right. The uh, tar sands, the, the, they're trying, they're really interested. That pipeline that they want to uh, make that goes from Alberta basically down to uh, California. Yeah. That they're always voting on. I mean, the, uh, Alberta wants that so badly. I'll tell you. By the way, this is Ophira speaking, in case my voice sounds too much the same. <laughs> right, this is Jackie speaking, saying that um, California wants everyone's water and oil. And uh, as always. As always, just build another pipeline. We will pay for it. And then we will all walk your dogs. Because uh, <laughs> Dog walking was created, I believe, in us in uh, in California. That's right? where it started. Yeah, yeah. Well, it was an actor who said, "I can't go to the office. What do you need done? <laughs> you know what? I can't." Uh... <laughs> okay. What else? Uh, Pilates. I knew this joke about how Pilates isn't real. It's not real. That was created. Whenever I see a yoga studio, I say, to, "I say, you're welcome," because that's what we made. We made that up. <laughs> that's not real. Oh, and there's Piloxing. Pil pil What's Piloxing, Piloxing is the new craze. Oh, Piloxing? Piloxing. Is it boxing and Pilates? Boxing and Pilates. Stretchy, stretchy boxing? You do some boxing and then you, I don't even think you take the gloves off. You just start, you do those 100s where you're pumping your arms at your sides with gloves on. Wow. Yeah. Wow. They do, we just combine anything. Yeah, there's I want to um, do like Jagya or something like that. Ooh, Jagya. <laughs> I met this woman who, uh, she told me, I do angry yoga in Brentwood. And I was like, wait, how can it, why should it be, it shouldn't be angry. What it's is angry yoga. yoga? She said that it's, uh, it really gets the, it gets to the meat of the, you really get some workout. And I was like, you know what I like to do? Take a walk <laughs> that ends in a coffee shop. That's my favorite like kind of music. exercise. And I enjoy flowers. <laughs> I like to read flowers. a book. Is there a, I did ask Andy, my husband, the other day, I was like, should we hike? <laughs> and, uh, <laughs> right? I like that it's just like an open ended, like, goal. <laughs> well, it, it, it was inspired by the fact that he asked me, like, three months ago, should we adopt? Whoa, and I said, that's a different question. Well, I know, but we've already discussed it. Yeah. And so we're in the car, and it just comes up out of the blue, and I'm like, did you want to adopt? And he goes, no. But should we? <laughs> I was like, like, like recycling, <laughs> like I don't know, like going to church, oh, like voting, like yeah. voting. Yes, it's an obligation. It's a requirement, <laughs> right? And I said, yeah. let's not. If it's an obligation, I'd rather. And then I was telling him, I, and should I, we? Should we? And I, was, and I genuinely, I was telling my friend Elizabeth Decker this in Seattle, and in the middle of that story, she goes, "You guys should foster." And I said, you should fucking foster. <laughs> oh my God. That's the no. most work in the world. No. You know who fosters? Angels. Angels foster. I, I mean, that is, yeah. That is your, that's your life. That's yeah, it. I think it should if be. If we fostered, that's what we would be doing.